Students, now we would like to discuss about coordinates. Yesterday, we have discussed about moving and turning. Now, we will continue to discuss about coordinates. Mm, the first one is, I want to ask you something. Do you still remember uh, what vocabulary uh, would you use to express or uh, show a direction? For example, clockwise, anti-clockwise, half turn, quarter turn, and many more. Now, we will use coordinates to mm, look for something's location. Okay, the first one, you have to pay attention to this picture. Now, if I ask you, where is the pumpkin located? Okay, pay attention. In coordinates, we know that there is x-axis. This line is called x-axis. Or in Bahasa, we call it Sumbu X. And we have Y axis. Or in Bahasa, we call it Sumbu Y. Now, we, if you want to write X and Y axis, the first one, we have to write the X axis first. For example, where is this pumpkin located? Look at the X axis first. Look at the line here. Oh, it's three. It's the X. And look at the Y axis. Oh, it is four. So, where is this pumpkin located? The X first and then Y. So, the pumpkin is in 3.4. Do you get it? Okay, let's continue to this game. Actually, uh, there, there is this picture in your learner's book, page 117. You may check it by yourself. You may practice by yourself as well, but you don't have to collect it to me, okay? Mm, look at the first question, what is at square 3.9? Remember that the x should come first, okay? So 3 is x, 9 is y. Look at the x axis or sumbu x. Oh, the 3 is in here. And where is the 9? Look at y axis. The 9 is in here. So what is at square 3.9? Ta-da! Oh, it's an octopus. So the answer is an octopus. Now, Look at number 2. Write down the coordinates of the shark. Let's find out the shark. The shark is in here. So, write down the coordinates. If I ask you to write down the coordinates, you should put the number. For example, like 3.99. Okay, remember, the X have to come first. So, what is the x? The 9. The y axis, 5. So, the coordinates of the shark is 9.5. Okay, we will continue later. Keep healthy. And then, don't forget to practice at home, ya. Thank you. Assalamualaikum.